Are we good? Hmm? Sorry guys. You need to wait. Hmm? So hello guys, there is no escape from Cebu, so let's make the video together, shall we? Shall we make the video together? Okay. Alberto and I actually are very, very excited to announce that we want to kind of activate you as an audience. You know, you are the best audience a musician can dream of. You have been, and many of you have been there for the very start when I was making live record recordings a year ago, years ago. But I know many of you are musicians on all kinds of levels, and so... We are going to start monthly challenges video while Sibo is eating my hands. Meaning, we're going to activate you as player. It doesn't matter which type of instrument you have. If you have a fancy Steinway grand piano or a forte piano or a digital piano, it doesn't matter. But it's important to experience what we are talking here about, about here on the channel yourself and the best way to do that, that is by playing and I know many of you are playing but the possibility to share this with with us here on this channel and this is how we're going to work okay thank you Sibo we are going to invite you monthly to play some pieces some music and a certain metronome number of course because that's the challenge and so basically what we're going to ask from you or what we are inviting you to make is a video recording of a performance of a certain piece and then also answer some questions so we're going to ask you to reflect upon what you are playing and share that with us basically what we are going to ask you is just practice a piece of music and record it and then upload it to a youtube channel everybody if you has who has a youtube name has a youtube channel you can just upload a piece on your youtube channel and then make it unlisted so that you can share the link here in the comments below i will make one comment i think upon which you can reply and of course youtube doesn't like you to share links uh, certainly not youtube links so you will end up in the spam folder not spam folder but in the uh, hold for review folder but we will um, normally we don't, we don't uncheck, we don't whitelist those recordings of those uh, comments because there are too many. But for this video, of course, we will do that. So your recordings uploaded on a YouTube channel, unlisted or publicly, doesn't matter. Uh, just, <laughs> just reply to the first comment I make and then we'll find that. So and in this video, I would like you to just say your name. I mean, uh, you don't need to to change your YouTube name, but it's very pleasant, of course, when we know who we're talking to or who is playing. Say a little bit, talk, tell us a little bit, give us a little bit of information about yourself. What is your background? Are you a teacher? Are you even playing concerts? Um, are you following lessons? Are you a student? Where are you from? So that we get to know you a little bit better. And maybe just secondary, just say how you discovered the channel, how long ago, and what triggered you to become a subscriber. Mm -hmm. You're not a subscriber of my channel, by the way. There's no Cebu, for a reason, perhaps. Anyway, so you just take your phone, uh, you point it towards yourself, obviously, because we want to see a face that's, uh, that's convenient, right, for a video, and then you start playing. And we want a complete movement of one sonata. In this case, we're going to start with the Mozart C major sonata, Kachelverzeichnis 5, 4, 5. Details in the description box. And we would like you to play that in the Marshallist metronome number for this movement, which is quarter note 152. So obviously in whole beat. This is something, of course, obvious as well. Whole beat, if you're new here, uh, that is simply the historical way of using the metronome number of the metronome, I would say, where the metronome ticks indicate the subdivision of the note value. So you take your metronome, and if you have an option to show us that in the video as well, um, that would be cool, so we know that you were working with this metronome number and then you play the piece in one complete section. You can edit it, you can do whatever you want, make a fancy video of it or just play it once through. I mean, on an acceptable level, I would say, that we can show that and we can use that in the follow-up video The after, of course, you've sent in these recordings. More details in a second. And after you've played the piece, we would very much like you to um, go through a list of questions, a sense of what, what is your general feeling about this tempo? What, what did you like? Which places, which particular places did you like? What worked? 
what before didn't work. It can be technically, it can be musically, it doesn't matter. What did work and do you have a specific place to show us what you were pleased about, then show it to us. And also what didn't work, where, where did you struggle with? And show us that place and show us your struggle with this music. And in the future we will go through a bunch of other types of music that perhaps this uh, can come that you cannot can come up with with some things that really according to what you are thinking right now does not work and then finally what's your one question to us to alberto to me or to both of us because what we're going to do is we're going to take your videos and we're going to feature you on the channel so of course if you are responding massively to this uh, challenge then it's impossible for us to feature all of you we will have excerpts and of course especially your questions and your um, struggles and the things that you want to share with us we will bring that on the channel in the follow-up video and also guys this is important i know there is sometimes a little bit of a commotion around the things that we are doing and which is weird and not weird i mean we're just presenting a theory or a possible explanation for those metronome numbers and we do we do like to experiment with those and there are people who are really opposed to this i know and alberto knows this as well we all know that and so we will always reserve a spot or two at certain amount of percentages let's say that we have nine recordings that we can present or nine people that we can present a recording of if there are three people that really don't think this is a possibility the whole beat practice then we will serve those videos as well of course on the single condition that's what's in the word that also those people who really oppose this as something that they don't believe in or they cannot believe in that they also they have gone through the recording of that piece because that's the key of course of everything we want you to play we want you to experiment the same way we do and that will be fascinating so and on top of that we are building this community even on another level so all of that is pretty straightforward i think so just take your phone go sit at your piano practice and then when you think you're ready you just uh, record yourself say who you are where you're from all these things uh, the things that i've said play the recording and then the questions and for this challenge we would very much like uh, want you to to um, send in your recordings before or at the very last moment is 27th of may so that's more than just something more than three weeks and then we will um to have some we need some time to go through these recordings and videos that you sent in and we will feature that follow-up video the 3rd of june now all of this is very experimental you might have some ideas when you're working on this um, and then let us know these ideas because it's all up to us to you and to us to have these monthly challenges if we have them monthly um in a way that we want them to have um, I was thinking also on sharing them on Facebook first, but Facebook allows you pay the advantage there, of course, obviously, is that you can scroll through the different recordings much easier than on YouTube. But I think sticking to this platform for the time being is uh, easier for you. You can also, as a last point, if you really struggle with uploading a YouTube video, which is, I think, out of the question because it's so easy you can you can even upload that video to your youtube channel and again every one of you have a youtube channel there is no way to subscribe to this channel if you have not a google name and a google name is um or a youtube name is connected to a youtube channel um so that's easy but if you would prefer to have a dropbox link shared from dropbox i think we can also watch the videos i don't know but preferably a youtube link to start with and again in the future we'll see how this develops so guys i hope you like these channels and you this challenge and you're going to you know um you you go sit behind the keys of your instruments again doesn't matter what type of piano you play even this mozart sonata sounds great on harpsichord and on clavichord of course and even on an organ it's possible this this sonata is very i mean you can you can play it on any type of keyboard and then share that with us massively and so that was it 
Uh, leave me in the comments below also what you think about this challenge and give this video a thumb up a thumbs up if you really like it and if you are your end level of enthusiasm is going through the roof then share this video also with people you know that you might have been talking to in the past about this what we are doing here this temporary reconstruction and people even that might be a little bit a little bit skeptical because we want to bring all of you on board guys this is about experimenting in a certain direction of a possible solution as we very much believe this whole bit practice is the most obvious solution to all the problems and there you have the king again videos long enough yeah i have to stop okay so let's wrap this up and then we're going outside for a walk i can make so fancy videos for all that at the end of the videos right yeah yeah we can play a little bit so uh share that with your friends with people who you know are a little bit skeptical that won't maybe that discuss but you know be, we have to go beyond the level of discussion just experiment because that's where the music starts okay guys this one that was it for this week i hope you enjoyed also Sibo, which was hard to escape today for to make this video and stay tuned because there is a lot of exciting stuff to come okay see you next video again bye okay I'm looking the best ever. My wife says so it is. Really? King Sibu comes to join us. He was stuck in his own blanket. Poor Sibu. There he is. Say hello to the people. Say hello to the people. They don't see you. Here he is. What have you got to say? Take it a minute. But I am in the midst of recording a video. So I would very much appreciate you. Just going back, hmm? sleep a little bit, live a little while, hmm? yeah. I want to announce to the people that they can send in recordings and that would be great because then they can participate instead of just watching the videos. Sebo, I need to make a video. This is a, this is a Wednesday video. Do you, do you understand English? No? Hmm? Woof, 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 woof. Woof, woof, woof. Be careful, I cannot miss my fifth finger. That's actually my first. Yeah. Even though I play so slow. Right. Okay, thank you, Sibo. Can I proceed now? No, not yet. You have to be silent. Because if you're not silent, I cannot talk to the people. Hmm? That's problematic, yeah? And I know. Can we continue, Sibo? Yeah, okay, thank you so much. Sibo. What's going on? Hmm? Not enough attention. Yeah, and you? And you? Cozy. Cozy again. Campion. Eh? And the campion. Oh, we did a fantastic round. Yeah. When you see the men, you all feel okay. Yeah. Hmm? 40 kilos. Hmm? Oh, Oh, Sibyl. Mm. Yeah. Again, I need that finger the most. Oh, that is also an important finger. <laughs> yeah, you're a strong guy. Mm. You're a strong guy. <laughs>